G Cobb with you on the Birds uh, football report. <laughs> now, the big thing that I want to talk about now is Fletcher Cox. Fletcher Cox is getting some criticism. I was on the uh, WIP morning show with Angelo Cataldi, and Angelo is very critical of, of Fletcher saying that he's not giving you anything. The fact that he didn't have any tackles, no sacks during the game. Now, I'm not going to be overly critical of, of Fletcher because I understand that that happening because he was getting double teamed most of the game. Uh, there were times on run plays where he, there were plays where he had some poor plays where he's getting blocked by somebody that he shouldn't be getting blocked by. And, and Fletcher's not going all out all the time. But I think the big thing that they've got to do with Fletcher Cox is they need to have a talk with him because he needs to look at Aaron Donald. Aaron Donald gets double teamed all the time as well. Now it's a difficult situation where you're getting double teamed. But what Fletcher should do is you attack one of those offensive linemen. You attack one of them. You don't you don't deal with both of them. You attack one. If you beat him, a lot of times that other guy could miss you and all of a sudden you're in the quarterback's face or you're going to make the play on a, a running play. But Fletcher is still comp he's, 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 he's capable of being a dominant player because when he gets one-on-one, -on -one, he can basically take anybody and run them into the backfield. He is he's powerful as he's ever been. But he's got to give you something when he's out on the field. He can't be taking plays off because there are times when you say he knows he's going to be double teamed, so he just takes that play off. No. You attack one of those guys, you can beat him, and you can still be a factor in on the play. And they got to talk to Fletcher about that because he doesn't need to be out there taking plays off because he's capable of being a dominant player on any play. You can see uh, when, he, <laughs> when he attacks anybody. There, I don't know, there are very few people in the league that can block Fletcher Cox. He's still a dominant player and uh, should, probably going to go to the Hall of Fame. He's, he's definitely one of the best players of his era. Uh, but come on, you got to give us something every play, though, Fletcher. That's what the, the defensive uh, uh, line coach, Tracy Rocker, he's got to talk with Fletcher about that. Because when he's out there, he should be trying to be dominant. Like I said, you see Aaron um, Aaron Donald of the Rams, who a lot of people consider to be maybe the greatest defensive player ever. I mean, he's done things nobody's ever done. But what he does is, okay, first of all, he's in great shape. You know, Fletcher's in good shape, but I don't know that he's, he's in great shape. Uh, but he's got that dominant uh, uh, capability uh, that Aaron Donald has. Aaron Donald does a lot of his with quickness and and, and, and ability with his hands and things. But Fletcher is just so uh, strong and powerful uh, that he can pretty much run over anybody. And and when he's uh, intent on beating a block, man, he can make it happen. So he's a great player. But the thing you got to do is on the field during the games, he's got to give you 100% all the time. Now, that's what they got to talk to Fletcher about because he cannot say he's giving 100% all the time. And I understand he wants to be smart and preserve himself. But when he's on the field, you got to give us what you got. And that's what they got to have a talk with Fletcher about that. Because he's a great player, but there are times he's taking plays off because he's going to be double teamed. And he knows he's going to be double teamed. And he is singling up those other guys uh, because J uh, Javon Hargrave and um, Hassan Ridgeway, they were single blocked because they're doubling. They're sliding the line towards Fletcher. They're going to double him. And that's why those guys are single blocked. But Fletcher still got to give them something on those plays when he's double teamed. Uh, and all you got to do is look at the, some of the tape of Aaron Donald, how he attacks one of the guys. And uh, a lot of times he can make something happen, even on those plays when he's double teamed. But they got to have that talk with Fletcher Cox. No doubt about it.